Okay. Let's just go for it. Scared. Hold me. Mom, hold me. Is it loud? HD. Of HD. Ooh. Pure and radiant. Oh the shit, it's the egg! To shrive clean the hearts of men. Called it. We're gonna touch him and then go in. The egg. Can we be in the egg? There is nothing more terrifying. Subtitles. Lee HD. <laughs> In that forsaken place, blood must spill. Blood of your fellows. Oops. Swamp. Swamp. Swamp mentioned. <laughs> oh God, You're more lava. Safe. They just happen to be on the losing side of a war. Fired iron. Fired wall. Um. Okay. Toes. Oh my god, okay, that that thing's giving me final or full metal alchemist dog vibes. Oh dear god, please no. It is not a nice looking lion. Mother, wouldst thou truly lordship sanction in one so That's not Mikola, that no. Of life. Unless. Why is that in Millennia's arena there? New spells? We could throw hands? I presume you too are keen to know. Oh shit. Just what kind of Mikola is doing here. Ooh, it's like the dancers from Dark Souls 2. And 3. Is that a, is that a porcupine? Those stripped of the race. I don't think you should do that. That's a long. <gasps> the snake is so cute. Oh, okay. See ya. I will not be far behind. He starts. Cool, cool. That's so cool. I wonder if that's uh, Mikola. Cause that was my. F that's Mikola. The only way that could possibly be him. <laughs> the mask. See, anybody that doesn't know, um, a lot of Miyazaki's stuff is inspired by Berserk. And like even this helmet here that is an Elden Ring. I, I don't can't remember if it's any of the Soulsborne, but it's also kind of, you know, Berserk-esque. Won't well, say for spoiler reasons, you know. It's only a 30-year-old anime. Mesmer? Mesmer? Oh, so it's not Mikola. Okay. Because that was my prediction that either, like, he comes out of the egg and he turns into some, like, weird shit. I mean, he's probably gonna turn into some weird thing because we don't really know what Mog did to him. Play to the end. Oh, the, the collector's edition? Yeah, the collector's edition. I was like, I don't need it. It's like $300 Canadian, though. It's like, what the fuck? But this DLC, people are saying it's $40, but it looks massive. I think they said there's 10 weapons. It's insane. You took off work till the 25th? Oh no. I wish to see the pretty boy. Yeah, that was, that was... They didn't show... They showed a lot without showing a lot. They're very good at doing that. That is a freaking weird-ass hippo. Where did it go? There's like the dancers, which are cool. Yeah, is that a hippo or a porcupine? I don't... Or that area is the size of Limgrave. Oh my god. I'll never forget what you did to Gale. <laughs> For some reason I always thought you were talking about Dark Souls 3 Gale and I was like oh my god Gale. Longest DLC ever. Miyazaki's like guess what there's gonna be a swamp. I'm like oh my god. Yeah it's like a whole I mean they took a while with it which is good. I mean I'd rather them take a long time. It's like with Bloodborne. The Bloodborne DLC was pretty big. They were gonna make it into two but they put it into one. So That's pretty cool. The tree with the bodies hanging and the dragon slayer. 
It's been a while since I played because I played pretty much right when the game came out. So I'm trying to remember it. I'm trying to remember who this is. I think they're on some of the statues. They look like they could be related to the funny hat lady. I can't remember her name. Um, magic lady. <laughs> Laser lady. They, like, they kind of look like they'd be related. It's got all the blue aesthetics going on. More lava. Reminds you of Bloodborne. Uh, we got the flame giant 2.0 where he's just like, I am the kill now. I am the fire now. We got some weird tapeworm looking thing. Is that like a dragon tapeworm? Is that why it's massive? Toes! They freaking love their feet, man. <laughs> What's with Miyazaki and feet? Every time. There's always feet. It's like, like, I don't like this thing. This thing makes me uncomfortable. Like, it, it literally looks like the dog from Full Metal Alchemist. Uh -huh. Always a fire giant. There's always a swamp. There's always a fire giant there's always seems like another omen yeah that's why i'm like he doesn't look completely omen omen but still a long boy he's got snakes and like dragon like i'm trying to think because he says mother so could that mean he's one of the god children I'm trying to think who wasn't mentioned. There was the one that became the tree. So is it the one that became the tree? Because I assume we either go into the past or the future. Look at his spear. Pretty sick spear. Ooh. Mission accomplished. The snake. Look at the snake. It's so cute. Yeah, he's a long boy. I thought he had six fingers for a second, but they're just very long. Land of Shadow itself, a place where the player will visit and walk in the steps, Amigla. Oh, that's not good. Perhaps as guessed by many players who saw the art that was released, is in fact Mikola, and it is he who traveled to the Land of Shadow, and it is the players who will be tracing his path and following in his footsteps. I'm trying to see what he's trying to do there. Oh boy. That's probably not going to be good. This guy's sick. He's so cool. He's obviously got some kind of dragon blood or dragon influence in him. Bereft of light. Also, the new move sets pretty cool. The kicking, I'm here for it. That spell looks so pretty. That's so cool. I presume you too are keen to He reminds know. me of the guy from Dark Souls One. Just what kind of make a Giant bear dragon, dragon head. Yeah, because I can't see Mikola being bad if this isn't because we're following him in the past, right? And we know he was like the kinder of the people, and he took all the misfits and gave them a place to exist. What the heck is this? Headless horseman, except instead of a <laughs> head and something. He's a long man. That looks like Madeir's boss arena, and I'm getting war flashbacks. Those What's with people sitting on their horses and crushing them in this game? <laughs> He's, this horse is like, help me. The horses love their people. It's the second one. I like all the speculation about how Mikola is parallel to the character. I'm so interested about his character in general. What the? What do you do? I just noticed it's down here, and he's pulling it. Oh, it's like a root. I don't think it's a weapon. Um, you should get that checked out. Of gold, shadow. He's so- is he wearing pants? Are you pantsless? He's got a short skirt. <laughs> he's got no pants, but his arms are so freaking long. And he's got two snakes. So the twin snakes. No pants, just snake. <laughs> yeah, I don't need pants. I just have a snake. Snick is snick. And the dr there's like dragon wings on the snakes too. The spear is so cool. This weapon kind of reminds me of um oh god, I'm forgetting boss names. Beep 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 the, the one who is the beast, but then not the beast. He's like the ugly looking beast and then he turns into the cool ass beast. The dog. That's what it reminds me of. Darkness dog man. 
Yeah, snakes. Malaketh, thank you. I knew it started with an M. <laughs> if there's any games that are like, what name was it again? That's this game. America. Malaketh. That's pretty cool. Look how shiny he is. Shiny. Giant people on the smallest horse. Yeah, they couldn't get a bigger horse. I hope we get to see a lot of him. And we know, I mean, we know how it ends. So. At some point, he's sleeping in the tree. I think he's, is he trying to grow the tree? Is that why he was in the tree in the first place? And then Mog is like, you're mine now. I'm going to do some weird shit. And then he takes him. Maybe he's trying to keep the tree alive because that's where the people lived. So. The collector's edition does look really cool. But I don't actually have any space. Well, look how long he is. His armor and everything reminds me of the Dark Souls 3 dragon area aesthetically, which is cool. We have helmet too. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then you get the official soundtrack. You get the. Do you get the full game with this? Or do you just get. I assume you get the base game and the DLC, right? <laughs> the helmet you can buy. Oh my god. Didn't they have a Millennia's helmet? Ooh, the art book, though. I'm here for the art book. The, the little snake's got little wings. I'm excited. This comes out in June. Okay. Okay. I could beat Yakuza 7 and Gaiden maybe by June. It's a big ass for a character we know nothing about, so it makes me think there's a lot to that character. Yeah, because the statue... I guess the one for the original was Millennia, right? And we didn't really know anything about her, but she's important, so... I would be surprised if he's not related to them in some way. Because they have, like, half-brothers and sisters and stuff, but... I don't know. You don't have space for it, so it's okay. Yippee! Well, I'm excited. I feel like it's been forever since I played Elden Ring, but I streamed over 200 hours. <laughs> I'm still uploading parts on YouTube. I'm at like part 50 something. Yeah, see, this is how Mikola ends up. Spoilers. Um, if you do the boss fight in the Blood Palace, you find out that this is him and some creepy shit's going on because Mog's infusing him with his blood and other stuff, I guess. And he's... He doesn't look that big in most screenshots and stuff we've seen of him. So I don't know why he's so big. But yeah. I'm excited. All the DLC. From, people are like, oh, $40 for a DLC. That's a lot. Yeah, but From Software always has good DLC. And like their DLCs are better than some complete games. So yeah, you know. Hong, can I just re-download it tonight? You're going to try multiplayer? I think the multiplayer has been better now. And Lenchy, thank you for 76 months! Chromasip. They made the skybox even more impressive. I know, it looks so pretty. It's like, um... I can't remember what they're called that you put above beds. The tree looks very, um, not okay. I mean, we did set the tree on fire, so... It actually kind of looks better than it did when it's on fire, so... <laughs> you know, bed drapes? Yeah, like the... They had it in the castle. Finished up Devil May Cry 5. Is that your first time playing? Normal is like $30. Yeah. I think it's like $50. How much is it Canadian? Probably $50. Mosquito net. <laughs> yeah, we need... That's that's how we save the, eld, the tree. The Halig tree. We put a giant mosquito net over it. No keep all the bugs out. Where's Bald? Baldur's Gate was updating. Big update, apparently. Would you like to play this game? Yes, Steam. I would like to play this game. Thank you very much. No more malaria. <laughs> I thought you said Melania. There's Melania and Melania and then Malaketh and then Merica and then... What was the other one? Mikola? Not to be mistaken with Mikolash from Bloodborne. <laughs> Don't forget all the Gs. Godfrey, Godfrey, Morgot, Mog. <laughs> Morgot, Gorgot, Margit, Margot. <laughs> it's like, what? 
I'm bad with names normally, and they're just like, ha, this is gonna be funny. Funny. Damn George R. R. Martin. Yeah, he's literally like, these are my initials, so like let's roll with it. 